A deadline set in the U.S. Department of Justice's escalating dispute with the state of Texas and Governor Greg Abbott. Your eye on Texas starts at the border in Eagle Pass. That's where the DOJ says Texas has until 1 o'clock in the afternoon today to remove the newly installed floating barriers and razor wire the governor authorized in an attempt to deter illegal border crossings. The DOJ says the state's actions violate federal law and raise humanitarian concerns. So far, the governor appears unmoved, tweeting, quote, we will see you in court, Mr. President. Now to Presidio, Texas, the border town closest to Big Bend National Park, where Customs and Border Protection officers intercepted nearly 18 pounds of cocaine. Here's the kicker. The drugs were hidden inside large wheels of cheese. The cheese was declared by the driver, but upon further inspection, seven bundles of cocaine were found inside. And to the Austin suburb of Georgetown, where the National Transportation Safety Board is investigating, after a single engine plane crash, uh, it crashed through an unoccupied duplex. Remarkably, the three people on board have already been released from the hospital. The crash came just hours after a deadly crop duster plane wreck in Houston. We reached out to the Bureau of Aircraft Accidents to see if this is a trend. Turns out airplane crashes are actually down this year, just 44 in 2023.